Hey, I'm Steve Sievers. And I'm David. And we're the creators of Super Fire Studios. We're so excited to be here in the first day of the Burbank Film Festival. We'll kick it off here with Women in Film. Oh, yeah. Some wine and cheese. Maybe wine. Oh, that's right. For the wine, mainly. Buy the great film from Timber. Oh, and look. Here's twice Academy Award nominated animator Bill Clinton. How you doing, sir? How you doing? Good to be here. Enjoying the spread, Bill? Oh, and this is Jeff Rector. Jeff, this is Bill Clinton. Hey, Bill. Thanks so much for coming out. We really appreciate it. And I hope you're going to come to my sci fi night on Saturday night. Yeah, I think so. It's oh, yeah. going to be a lot of fun. I just lost my place in line now. Right. Now, Dallas, do you have a favorite Idol Lucy episode? Oh, Vitamin Avengement. Oh, yeah. Hands yeah. down. I mean, there's so many good ones, but if I have to pick, that's yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. That's a tough one. That, that's the little bit that, that I had to use for the audition. Really? Oh, is that right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no it's not in the show. Oh, they, they start you with a tough one. Wow. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. And she started riffing, and it was <laughs> a genius. <laughs> I had a day to prepare, and uh -huh. um, a whole day. A whole day. Yeah. And unfortunately, I hadn't spent my life in front of that very skit, so yeah, sure. I thought, I'm not going to worry so much about the lines. I know the con and right. just have fun and try and amuse them. Yeah, it was great. Uh, it was a great audience. Lisa was already hired, so I, I got to do this stuff. Oh, how exciting. <laughs> and and just, just to let uh, me and you know uh, what, what dates and where that's going to be? Oh, that's going to be at the Greenway Court Theater October 1st through January. Probably the beginning of January. January. Yeah. Hi, the Philadelphia Film Festival. Oh my God! Did you hear this story? Oh, oh you got to tell Lisa. Oh shit! Uh, the, was, you and Jared Harris. You know, I was looking there. Look over the it was the opening night. It was up on this penthouse. And you started walking on the ledge. So first of all, I was dressed as a dead Buster Keaton. Yeah. He promoted Buster his King, film right, at this festival because right, right. he wasn't there to do something. Yeah. And then he no. climbs down and is hanging by his hand. Real Buster Keaton's son, or Harold Lloyd, I guess. And he was hanging there, and the poor hostess of the evening shit her pants. I mean, she did not know what, I mean, because if you had fallen, I mean, that would have been a real story. Yeah. I mean, were you, were you scared? I, the PR guy who knew what was the yeah. dared me to do something in front of all these blue hairs. Right. And, uh, and that's what I decided to do. But the funny part was, I had gone over and checked the railing to make sure it was strong enough to hold me. Yeah, and then I just kind of dove over and caught on at the last second and yeah. hung there. And then I looked underneath and I realized I could climb under where no one could see me. Oh, that just, been that's when you guys looked over. Oh. And Jared, Jared was like, hey, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you were a stuntman. I just thought you were an actor. I didn't know you were yeah, I actually didn't know you were a stuntman. The trademark was uh, getting hit by a clock and recording this whole thing. Yes, I, I have. Uh, a story like that. You can't let a story like that get away. No, and just... what's really weird was I was going to reach down and, and grab him, you know? I thought, uh -huh. well, what happens if I grab his hand and he, you know, I screw up, screw it up. <laughs> and All right, Bill Plimpton, the man who killed Will Keenan. I, I, I like the sound of it. I've only seen your face when you look down. And you know the fault I had?